86% was for simple possession. Not sales, simple possession. Now, how many man hours did we use our public funds for that locked these people up, that was harming no one? One of the biggest problems we had in the penitentiary was drugs. Most of the killings, most of the power struggles were over drugs. Now, if you've got 40-foot walls, gun towers, no rights, strip searches at will, dogs, I mean, every surveillance technology known to mankind, and you can't keep drugs out of that controlled environment, how realistic is it to think you're going to keep it out of the freest country on earth? Thirty-five years later, a trillion dollars, we have more people incarcerated than any other country on earth, and yet we still claim to be the freest country on earth. Anybody that deals in reality, they cannot support the drug war because it can't support itself. I was a part of the system for so long and believed it and fought it. And then look in the mirror one day and go, you're part of the problem instead of part of the answer? It sucks. You can be wronged right now today and be 100% correct and prove that you've been wronged. But if you don't have the money to fight it, you're done. Their biggest weapon they've had through all this is our silence. We, we accept the abuse. You know, they kick child molesters out of prison to make use for a non-violent drug user who has no victim. Why are we wasting this money? Why did you lock that kid up and give him a lifetime record where he'll never be able to get a good job when he had no victim and he harmed nobody? <laughs>